First and foremost, when um, Step Up Nigeria came to our school to talk about anti-corruption, I became interested in it, knowing fully well the effect it will have on the society as a whole. So when we educate them, it means we are fighting it from the root itself. They are going to become the leaders of tomorrow. So when you teach them the right thing now, they grow with that habit and it, it helps in the long run. One of the first things we did was that when they came and introduced themselves and gave us materials, uh, uh, we started using the materials right on. We now started uh, looking at how we could make it part of our skin. Mrs. Feromi, she sent me some further materials again, the toolkit, so that each class would have a copy. I gave it to the teachers, we had a training, and then I made it part of our skin, uh, part of our uh, security education skin. Here on, our teachers start teaching it. As I speak to you, they are part of our exam questions. They are teachers, teachers use the toolkit to develop their lesson notes and then also they are teaching it in the class. I attended your program 2019 about anti-corruption. Actually, I attended with the head teacher, Mr. Jonathan. And then uh, we came back. He had to train other teachers on anti-corruption. And then as at uh, last time, he told us we should include it into this uh, scheme, which we did. Myself personally now, I taught a uh, corruption fourth week, and then uh, sixth week, and then eighth week. This week we are in. We've done a corruption concept. We've done types. We've done uh, courses. And then this week now we're doing uh, consequences of a uh, corruption. My teacher is Miss Mary. She taught us about causes of corruption and the consequences. In culture, we are well to celebrate uh, and no questions are asked about the source, the source of the world. Corruption can easily occur if people are aware that having more wealth means they are more respected and accepted. They will not be deterred from engaging in corrupt practices. I am happy that the teaching of anti corruption has come to my school. Thank you. Honestly speaking, if I have my way, I would uh, so influence this. Uh fight against the corruption so that every school, every child will be involved in me. I will take it personally on my own to make sure that uh, I call on some other heads of school to see what they can do to, do to replicate whatever we are doing in BJ school. And the fight against it should be holistic. Everyone should be involved in it, whether children or adult, all of us should be involved in it. If we don't do anything about it, the time is going to come that all of us will live in regret. That's why we must fight it.